Well, that sure was... something. I mean, I wasn't expecting the movie to be perfect, but it could have been at least... entertaining? It was trying too hard to be the next big thing, you know? <laughs> well, I'm glad I'm not the only one who didn't like it. H hey do you want to take the long way home? There's a park nearby. Why? Because you're going back home tomorrow, a thousand miles away. After today, we'll go back to just being online friends. I want to make these moments last, you know? Oh, great. Thank you. Come on, I'll show you the way. Wow, there's no one here. I didn't think we'd have the park all to ourselves. I guess you're right. Our movie did end pretty late. Still, it kind of feels weird being the only ones here. You think it's a good thing? Yeah, having no one here actually makes me more comfortable. Well, shall we? I can't believe you're leaving tomorrow. It feels like you just got here. But, you know, at the same time, it feels like I've always known you this way. What do I mean? Come on, you know, like face-to-face, -face, being physically present instead of being on a other side of a computer screen. Don't you feel the same way? <laughs> I knew it. Now that we spent the last few days together, I can't imagine it being any other way. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to sound so sad, it's just... I'm, I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> Gosh, I know we'll still talk and always be there for each other, but you know what I mean, right? There's something about physical presence that you can't get online. Good, I'm glad you feel the same way. I want to tell you how much I appreciate you coming all the way over here just to see me. It means a lot to me. It's not nothing. I mean it. I'm not used to having friends. I've always been so shy and bad with meeting new people. Not to mention I'm awful at small talk. I'm not going to lie. Even with you being there for me through all these years, I've still been kind of lonely. Now that i finally spent some time with you, a real friend, it's going to be hard when you leave tomorrow. Sorry, I, I don't mean to sound so gloomy again. I'll just tough it out like I always do. I'll be fine. Hey, don't just put your arm around me. What are you doing? Oh, you were trying to comfort me. <laughs> of course. If you were going to comfort me, I'd rather you pat my head. Yeah, like in anime. It's not weird to do it in real life. It's only weird if you make it weird. Plus, no one's even here. It'd just be between you and me. So if you really want to comfort me, just go on and do it. <sighs> yeah, it feels good. Thank you. I'm not blushing. My cheeks are just naturally rosy. You never noticed? <laughs> anyway, shall we keep walking? Actually, uh, there is something I want to ask you. I is that okay? Nervous? I I'm not nervous. I just wanted to ask you something. A favor, actually. But before I ask, can you promise me that you'll do it? What? No, I'm not going to make you do something awful. Well, maybe if you wouldn't like doing it, I'm not sure. It's, it's just, it's something important. What is it? You, you, you have to agree to it first. Come on, I'm your best friend. You trust me, don't you? Okay, good. Thank you. Could you, uh, can you, wait, no, would you, um, 
Shut up. It's hard to say, okay? Just give me a second. Kiss me. I said, kiss me. You heard me right. I decided not to beat around the bush and just say it. You already said you'd do it, so kiss me. Why? D do you really need to ask that? Fine, look. You already know how antisocial I can be. I've never figured out how to make friends, and I'm so awkward around strangers. You're the only person I can be myself around. I'm in college, and you're basically the only friend I've ever had. Once you leave, what are the chances that that'll change? If I can't even make one friend, then finding a boyfriend is basically impossible. Perhaps I'm being too pessimistic, but let's face it. If you don't kiss me now, it'll never happen. I want to experience it at least once. Is that the only reason? Well, I, uh... I... Look, I like you, okay? You're the only guy I know, the only person I know. Of course I like you. You're so kind to me and you've always made me laugh. When we spend time together, you make me feel like I'm important, that I matter. You've always been there for me. I know that was a lot to take in, and I know you don't like me back, but I swear it'll be only one time and then we can pretend like it never happened and we could just go back to normal. Uh, you, you actually kissed me. I know I told you to do it. I, I just can't believe it. This doesn't feel real. Did we actually do that or was I imagining it? I, I don't... Okay, I wasn't imagining it. I guess... I guess that's just it, huh? I suppose we should head back now. Huh? You want me to do you a favor now? I mean, you just gave me the biggest favor in the world. How can I say no? You... want me to kiss you? What? But you initiated it the first time, so... You want me to do it now. I don't understand. M moron Who are you calling a- You. You like me too. You've liked me for a long time now? No way. What is even going on? Am I dreaming? Are you pranking me? What am I waiting for? Oh, oh, right. You want me to kiss you. Um, okay. I'll just, I'll just lean over and... I guess that makes us official, right? Well, it doesn't really matter, does it? You're leaving tomorrow, and coming all the way down here is too expensive. This is the last we'll see each other for a while. You think a long-distance relationship can work? I mean, of course I'm willing to try it. Besides, there's practically no other way, right? Well, I guess that makes you my official boyfriend. <laughs> I hope one day we'll be able to move close together. But let's worry about that later. We should try and make the most of our time we have left before you leave. <laughs>